Hey guys. So, the request that I get by far, by far, by far the most uh, for my videos is to do a room tour. And this is not a room tour. But uh, I recently bought a bunch of things for my room little decor things and extra things to splice it up so I thought I would do a little sort of home decor haul to like tide you guys over because I'm gonna do a room tour just not not yet okay uh, most of this stuff is just bought locally it's either from winners or Target or like the dollar store but I think it's really cute and I think you guys are gonna like it so the other day I went to Winners, which is a Canadian chain, and I bought a bunch of cute stuff for my room. Of course, it is Easter-ish time now, so there were loads of pastel things and things with bunnies, and this is just like my time to shine after all of the warm reds and stuff that seem to be in trend during the winter, which I just, just can't do. So pretty much everything was an impulse buy. I don't know what I was expecting going in, but I picked up these two really, really cute plates. Uh, they are pink, obviously they came in blue and I should have gotten blue because all of my balls are pink and I want to like hang them on the walls like an old lady, but I can't, I can't convince myself to buy things in another color if they come in pink. And this one was $3.99 Canadian, this, this one was $4.99, so not bad. Also from Winners, you guys know I like my like Baroque, Baroque, whatever frames, like this sort of thing, very intricate, fancy. So I saw this puppy, and usually I don't go for like the multiple frames connected sort of thing, because I feel like it limits you, because like on this wall I can arrange everything however I want, but Usually frames from winners are kind of expensive and this whole set was $9.99 so I was like damn girl I'm gonna put like pictures of my cats and me and Tristan in our Lolita and OG cords This is also from winners. I don't know if it really counts as home decor, but it sits in my room and it's cute So I'm gonna include it. Um, I am a sucker for anything with donuts I don't know when it came over me, but I just need anything with a donut print. It does not matter the cost. So I didn't even look at the price of this. I actually still don't even know how much it is. Oh, look. Wait. 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 $5.99. So not bad for the donut glory. And it will match my deco donut chocolate other makeup bag. I don't need two makeup bags, but they both have donuts, so... This one was from Winners, this one was from Toxic Blossom a uh, long time ago, but I included them because they match. And uh, I did a blog post uh, that includes this back in November when I went to Halcon, so I guess I'll link that. It's kind of old, but oh well. Moving right along. Uh, you guys know that I work in retail at this like local sort of department store place, and I was tidying the bedding section and saw these adorable pillowcases. It was just a pillowcase, so it was like two dollars or something for two of them. And it's like this beautiful muted pink with white polka dots and it goes so nicely with my bedding and it's really awesome because I've just been using like gross mismatched pillowcases that just kind of make everything look sad. So now I have happy things to put my head on when I sleep. And I'm sitting on one of them now because I'm like too short for this chair. And if I don't do it, I'm like way, way the hell down here. Fun facts, I'm like five foot. Also from my, oh it's crusty. Also from my workplace, um, I am a massive, massive fragrance freak. I am big on candles. I am big on those wax cube things that you melt, and this, I'm also big on crystals, because I am light Buddhist, so I collect crystals, and we got in these awesome, uh, like, wax cube fragrance melting things, so this, actually, you put the candle in, 
and then there's like a little glass thing that goes over it that you put the cube in and then it heats it and then everything smells like dreams so i had to get that and it actually sits with all of my other crystals like a cute little sparkly shrine of wisdom and good vibes and that was like 14.99 but it was worth it oh to go with that again this isn't really decor but it w w whatever whatever it's my video i can do what i want uh, yeah. I picked up a few of the Yankee Candle tarts because I have an addiction and I can't stop. I got Honey Blossom, I got Semi Scoop, which is amazing, and I got Cotton Candy, which is a new one we got in for the spring. And it smells a little bit gaudy, but oh well, it's pink. Also, from my workplace department store place, it's called Price Mart by the way, but like, it's local and I don't know if I have many viewers that live here, so. Anyway, I got a little shelf, which is really cool because it matches my room really, really well and I'm actually going to be putting it sort of above the ledge thing that kind of looks like this already to hold my magical girl items. Because I have a little magical girl item collection and I need like more layers to keep it so the wands and the brooches and all the like perfume shaped things can just go where they need to go. Um, and it's really easy to install too, you don't need to like hack the whole wall down to put up a shelf. This was $24.99 but whatever. And I think that's everything from Pre-Smart. So, a while ago it was Valentine's Day, so some of the stuff I did buy a little bit ago. But I, of course, am very big on pink things and heart-shaped things, so around Valentine's Day I just kind of have to go and like... What's the word I'm looking for? I have to go and rampage all of the stores that sell anything for home or for arts and crafts or anything like that. So the dollar store is my best friend around Valentine's Day. So I got these pillows. I got three of them and this one actually says hug which is kind of nice because it reminds me of a candy heart and they just sit happily around my bed. It's good for little accent things and they're not that disgusting despite having come from the dollar store. So everyone wins. I also bought from the Valentine's Day section this little box still don't have a purpose for it and I didn't when I bought it but it's really cute it says I love you I love you heart I love you heart I love you which is how I feel most of the time and it just kind of sits on my vanity I'll probably put stuff in it someday it'll probably become that thing where like you find random little things and you don't know where to put them so you just kind of shove them in a place that's probably gonna be what this is but you know what looks cute on the outside so we're all happy also from the dollar store the other day I decided that I needed more floral garland just to lay over everything in my room so it feels like I'm inside of a garden um, so they had this like white rose garland this was the only garland they had but it's awesome, and I'm gonna put it all over the place. I got five uh, vines, five things of it, and I think they are five feet each, so that's a lot of flowers. And I wanted to buy more, but we got a text from my mom saying like, oh, they're pulling all the plows and the trucks off the roads. It's a big snow a disaster, which is what it's been for the past few weeks. So anyway, we had to hurry home so we didn't turn into yetis and die. But I got some flowers. I'm probably gonna go back and buy more and buy like colorful ones to weave in with these so it's not just like white, but maybe this will be my new look. Anyway, so that's it for me, you guys. Thank you for watching. I'm going to do a room tour and I know you guys want it and I want to do it too. And I'll probably say this, I, I should probably say this on video because this is what I say to most comments that request one. I want to do a room tour and I'm gonna do a room tour. But a lot of things in my room are DIY'd or painted by me or, you know, changed by me or made by me. Uh, and I have a lot more projects that I want to work on for my room. 
I just, I want my room to be complete and finished and polished and everything that I want it to be before I show you guys. Not because I'm ashamed or anything, but because you deserve to see like the full thing and not just, you know, that I did it too soon for the sake of doing it and it's not as good as it could have been. You know, since it was so highly requested, I want it to be top notch. So I hope you guys look forward to that. My feet are completely without feeling because I've been sitting on this pillow for too long because I'm too short for the camera. I hope you guys enjoyed and I'll see you next time. Bye.